State health leaders now say there are 98 cases of COVID-19 in Tennessee. Two of those cases here in Knox County. Campbell, Sevier, and Jefferson counties each have one case. Well, today, West Town Mall made the decision to close until March 29th. It joins several other businesses, lots of businesses, in fact, that are closing or altering hours to prevent the spread of coronavirus. And in just the past hour, the governor of the state of Tennessee, Bill Lee, says the state is preparing for a potential economic downturn. How long? He doesn't know. He did speak directly to helping small businesses, making up the vast majority of businesses across our state. We're making a significant investment in the rainy day fund. We're making a significant investment in uh, in a COVID-19 emergency fund. We will continue to uh, fund the BEP so that we have appropriate funding for education. Uh, we're appropriately funding 10 care. We'll make additional funds in some of those reserves and in programs that we think will be needed as like the healthcare safety net for the uninsured. Um, programs that will be needed for those who find themselves in a more difficult position because of what might come in the future. Health leaders say Tennessee will soon see a spike in confirmed cases as more test results come back. But state leaders say many of the people who have contracted the virus have already recovered. The governor says the next challenge for the state will be moving from testing to treatment. His office is working with the Department of Health, TEMA, and the military department to find and organize supplies. He also spoke to the head of the Grocers Association and heard reassurances the state isn't in danger of running out of food. The governor did appeal to people across the state to think of their neighbors in this time of uncertainty.